Hi buddy, this is Home Theater Man back with another video. Today I want to talk to you guys is, is about my Samsung QN9C TV. And one thing I want to let you know guys is they have added um, the last two form updates, 1410 and 1421. They've added more more processing to the TV and they added more storage, more uh, memory space to the TV. So I'm going to show you guys this. Um, and also, I want to talk to you guys about they fixed the color space too, which I'm happy about. So they fixed a lot of sounds and things in the TV. Uh, so basically, what they did was, and um, for more update, I'll show you here. I'll zoom in. For more update, 1421, 1410, and 1421 were the last two updates they did on this TV. Both of them, that both of those formats, they added more and more processing. They added more and more processing, and they also added more memory to the TV as well. So, I mean, that also, with that, when I was talking about Robert Zahn from Value Electronics, they also confirmed that with Samsung as well. They said by adding more processing and adding more memory to the TV, you can get a much better picture quality than what you were before when watching 4K movies and stuff. So, basically, the TV is performing much better now than it was before. I um, just want to show you guys that. Um, but anyways, um, this one 1410. You want to update to 1421, guys. Um, you want to on the Samsung C series and C series TV. You want to update to 1421. That'll get that'll get you the extra processing you need and the more memory you need. Again, the fact that they were able to do that with this TV was just outstanding. I see a big difference in picture quality. When watching this 4K movie, when watching 4K movies, and then also watching t Blu rays. I notice the picture is much clearer, it's much sharper. It's, it, they added more, like, everything about it, it just makes the, the picture quality look so much better than what they um, had, than what it looked like before, guys. You will notice a difference and when you watch it pop in a movie, like an older, especially an older movie, like, for instance, um, Crystification, you know, is a huge difference in push quality. If as if you have updated the TV to firmware update fourteen twenty one. And another thing I want to talk to you guys about is um, remember when they first released the Samsung TV on the C series model? When you would go to push, this is the one thing they fixed. When you would go, you, one thing you would have to do, one thing you couldn't do was um. So before, when you had color, when you thought we had color space to DCI P3, and you switched it over to BT 2020, you had to leave it on custom mode because if you didn't, you put it back to native custom mode, your people's faces would look so bloodshot red. That what do you mean? That they just look god awful, guys. The picture quality look. The faces and color tones were all out of whack. Again, let's just say this: um, when you put the TV in, when you put the TV in BT 2020 from DCI P3, you put it in 2020, and you put it over to native 4K. It would oversaturate all the colors, guys. The colors would be oversaturated. It makes your faces turn look like they got sunburn. It just wasn't any good. Um, they fixed this issue, guys. They fixed this issue on the C Series TV, which I'm really happy about, guys. Um, they finally fixed the issue. Um, good job, Samsung. Just want to let you guys know about that. So, just a bunch of updates they did over the years. I mean, over the last few months for this TV. They made the picture processing look much better and stuff, guys. And the picture quality, quality much better and stuff. I added more processing to the TV. Also adding um, more memory to the TV. Again, like I'm still not getting any grain, guys. I'm not getting no grain on this TV. It was before for all the film, I was getting uh, for all the film. I was getting a lot of grain, and I was getting some, mostly a lot of grain in this, in this picture. You see grain, guys, but was, you see it a lot. Now I don't see any, hardly any grain. It's so much more clearer the picture does. I'm really impressed, guys. Yeah, I do not have. I don't think I have a picture setting turned on. 
I do believe my, I'll show you guys my push clarity setting. It's turned off, guys. Um, just want to show you guys this. See, push the clarity setting is turned off. So by them adding more processing to the TV, get a much better picture overall, guys. And by adding, them adding more processing to the TV and adding more memory, get a much but cleaner and more clear picture overall, guys. With less grain and everything. Yes, grain is not a bad thing, but still, um, um, it's, it makes it look more much better, guys. Um. Again, please do like, subscribe to my channel, leave a comment down below your thoughts on. Let me know you guys thoughts on this. Um, I'm just really enjoy I'm enjoying the picture, the picture more now, guys. They fix the issues, these issues. I made the TV picture better. Um, I'm fair, man. Over and out. Take care, guys. Have a good day. Have a good day, guys. Take care.